climate crisis? Look, if we don't move on the climate crisis, we don't, we're going to see the, 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 you know, the North Pole, as the kids would say, we're going to see those glaciers melting. You're going to see sea levels rising up to three feet. That means we Yes, welcome back. This just sound like one clip I reacted at the World Economic Forum. This is the best job I've ever had. <laughs> and even though it's also the hardest job I've ever had, I will miss this job, our work, this mission, and most of all, this team every single day. But I take solace in knowing that I am leaving you in the best of hands. I learned everything I know about how to be a good father from Joe Biden. He is the best father I know and the best role model I know. And along the way, he's taught me a thing or two about politics and policy as well. It was like a fiction movie. Recently, Gateway published an article. I believe you have seen this clip on this channel. I decided to delete this video for simply because of the demonetization and I re-edit out part they don't want. Chilling World Economic Forum showcases technology that will allow the government to punish your thought and big business to spy on your brains. Imagine if you were a world where outside forces can now have the deepest thought and have total control over your lifehood. The World Economic Forum is fantasizing of a new technology that could turn his tweet like Zoom nightmare into reality. Breber reported during the web gathering in Davos, Switzerland, last month an attendee showed an omnibus presentation displaying a war which will allow employees at major companies to, to spy on their workers' brain activity. They will have the power to fire their employees and turn them into government authorities for simply thinking the wrong way. First off, a video. Uh, it's going to make you see the future and understand a wonderful future where we can use brainwaves to fight crime, be more productive, and find love. Let's roll. You're in the zone. Even you can't believe how productive you've been. Your memo is finished, your inbox is under control, and you're feeling sharper than you have in a decade. Sensing your joy, your playlist shifts to your favorite song. Sending chills up your spine as the music begins to play. You glance at the program running in the background on your computer screen and notice a now familiar sight that appears whenever you're overloaded with pleasure. And turn them into government authorities for simply thinking the wrong way. The presentation also suggested government will be able to use brainwave data for evidence in a crime. Yes, just imagine a world where they have absolute control of what you think. Totally insane. First off, a video. Uh, it's going to make you see the future and understand a wonderful future where we can use brainwaves to fight crime, be more productive, and find love. Let's roll. You're in the zone. Even you can't believe how productive you've been. Your memo is finished, your inbox is under control, and you're feeling sharper than you have in a decade. Sensing your joy, your playlist shifts to your favorite song, sending chills up your spine as the music begins to play. You glance at the program running in the background on your computer screen and notice a now familiar sight that appears whenever you're overloaded with pleasure, your theta brainwave activity decreasing. Could you take a quick look at my brain data? Anything to worry about? Your mind starts to wander to the new colleague on your team, whom you know you shouldn't be daydreaming about, given the policy against intra-office romance. But you can't help fantasizing just a little. But then you start to worry that your boss will notice your amorous feelings when she checks your brain activity and shift your attention back to the present. You breathe a sigh of relief when the email she sends you later that day congratulates you on your brain metrics from the past quarter, which have earned you another performance bonus. You head home, jamming to the music, with your work-issued brain-sensing earbuds still in. 
When you arrive at work the next day, a somber cloud has fallen over the office. Along with emails, text messages, and GPS location data, the government has subpoenaed employees' brainwave data from the past year. They have compelling evidence that one of your coworkers has committed massive wire fraud. Now, they're looking for his co-conspirators. You discover they are looking for synchronized brain activity between your coworker and the people he has been working with. While you know you're innocent of any crime, you've been secretly working with him on a new startup venture. Shaking, you remove your earbuds. The presentation also suggested government will be able to use brainwave data for evidence in a crime. Yes, your own thought could be you as evidence against you in a court of law if the globalists have their way. Just imagine this, using your brain against you. The presenter, though in an only one twist, claimed given big business, bosses and government power over your thought will show the positive use of brain monitoring technology. According to them, this is a positive move for brain monitoring technology. At the World Economic Forum, the annual gathering of globalist early in Davos, Switzerland, a presentation hit brainwave monitoring technology to allow employees to dictate how, how hard their employees are working, whether they get distracted, even if they have amorous feelings for co-workers. At the World Economic Forum, the annual gathering of the globalist elite in Davos, Switzerland, a presentation he bring with monitoring technology to allow employees to dictate how hard their employees are working, whether they get distracted, even if they have amorous feelings for co-workers. You cannot tell, you cannot only tell whether a person is paying attention to or their mind is wandering, but you can discriminate between the kind of things they are paying attention to, gosh, the presenter. Whether they are doing something like central tasks, like programming, peripheral tasks, like writing documentations or related tasks, like surfing social media or like surfing social media or online browsing, when you combine when you combine brainwave activity together with other forms of software and surveillance technology, the power become quite precise. A short video like you have seen here, imagine a workforce of the future in which an employee worries about but is pleasantly surprised when she gets a performance bonus for a good brain method showing her productivity. Well, this is totally insane. Climate crisis? Look, if we don't move on the climate crisis, we don't. We're going to see the, 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 you know, the North Pole, as the kids would say. We're going to see those glaciers melting. You're going to see sea levels rising, up to three feet. That means we.